you, can you predict on that? Uh, are you getting better with this supply chain disruptions? We're saying, you know what? Right now, there's been a 90-day um, delay on this particular product. Is, 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 uh, is it that? Well, it's not that much of a science yet. It is. I think one of the benefits that A1 happens to bring to the table is, um, again, through our vertical integration, but also through our supply network. We have manufacturing facilities located throughout not only um, uh, Asia, but we also have uh, manufacturing globally as well. So if there's an impact area, say in China, we can pivot to manufacturing in Bangladesh or Pakistan or India. Um, which allows us to be nimble in that in that regard. Um, some other uh, manufacturers don't have that luxury of having multiple supply channels. So, um, and we also have distribution points. We can bring in containers. Um, you know, right now Long Beach is heavily affected. Uh, there's, I think they're saying somewhere upwards of 500,000 containers that still have to be unloaded. Um, at port. So we have access to uh, New York, New Jersey ports. We have access to Jacksonville, to Miami, to Houston, to uh, Savannah. So a lot of it is, is diversion and being able to uh, utilize other channels into and in, inlays into the country in order to bring product in, uh, inside. So I think, again, it's, it's, it's the planning aspect is, is, is crucial at this time. Um, and so that's what we're seeing as the solution.